What is up guys and welcome back to Above the Middle, the place where we talk about all things personal development with me, Joe Gibson. I am so happy that you clicked on and that you are watching this. If you're into personal development, mental health, personal growth, this is the place for you to be. Click that subscribe button for more content. This week I wanted to talk to you guys about this really important thing that I have been making sure to do throughout my day and it's come off the back of a lot of stress. It's come off the back of a bit of a burnout and it's just making sure that you're looking after yourself. It's making sure that you're giving yourself what you need. So if you're like me who is very goal focused and if you're into personal development then I'm sure that you are, you can kind of get wrapped up in your goals. You get wrapped up in I need to be doing this, or I should be doing this or what should I be doing now. You get caught up in that mindset of just work, work, work. And you end up neglecting the one person who matters in all of this and that's yourself and as a result I end up burning out I end up feeling stressed I end up feeling anxious the quality of my work suffers because I forget to tend to myself so throughout your day I want you guys to ask yourself when you feel yourself getting really caught up in your work you feel like you're chasing something just to stop for a second and ask yourself what do I need what do I need in this moment? Not what should I be doing? Not what do I need to do? What do I need? And I can be sure if you ask yourself that you realise I'm feeling a bit hungry. I need a glass of water. I've got a really busy mind at the moment. Maybe I need to meditate. We need to make sure that we're taking care of ourselves. And I'm the worst person for this. I guess it's a bit ironic that a person who preaches about productivity and mental health actually neglects his own needs a lot, but I do, and it's just part of being a goal-focused individual. But we have to make sure that we're looking after ourselves, because at the end of the day, we're the ones who are going to get us from A to B, we're the ones who are going to reach our goals, and we want to make sure that our results are what we want. We want to make sure that we're putting in the best effort that we can, and in order to do that, we need to reserve time to look after ourselves be that eating some food, be that having a drink, be that meditating, be that going for a walk. We need to make sure that we are separating ourselves from our work long enough to just refresh and recharge. And this can be particularly stressful if you work a day job. So for me, I work a nine to five job and then on the side, I also do this work. So when I come home from a main job, I'm like, oh, well, this is all the time I have right now. I need to put it into my other work and into the YouTube channel and stuff like that and I'm more prone than ever to neglect my own needs and then after a week or two I'll be sat there and I'll be wondering why I feel quite miserable or I feel like I haven't had any time to myself or I feel extra anxious about things and it's because I've neglected the one thing that matters in everything and that's myself. So this was just a quick reminder for you guys to ask yourself throughout the day if you do feel like you're getting stressed or if you feel like you're getting wrapped up in goals, and you're getting wrapped up in things you should be doing. Stop yourself and ask yourself, what do I need? We can have these big dreams, we can have these big goals, we can have these million tasks we're working towards, but we're the ones who are going to get us from A to B. So we want to make sure that we're feeling good in ourselves, that we're tending to ourselves, that we can be fresh enough to then go to our work and be like, I can perform at my best, I can do my best, and everybody else is going to see your best as well. So that's all I wanted to say. Thank you so much for watching. I don't usually post midweek videos, but I felt like this was just a really important subject. I've taken a couple of days off work just to relax, just to be with myself, and I felt so much better because of it. It's Sunday morning, I've woken up, I feel fresh, and as a result, the little bit of work I'm going to do today is probably going to be miles better than the work I would have done when I was anxious, when I was feeling low, when I was feeling stressed. So thank you so much for watching guys. Check back on Wednesday for another video where I'm going to talk about identity-based habits. I'm really excited about this one. It's work that James Clear does. If you haven't read Atomic Habits, highly recommend it. Click that subscribe button. Do you find yourself in similar positions? Because I know I find myself in this position a lot. Leave a comment down below and I will see you on Wednesday. Thank you so much for continuing to support the channel. I really appreciate all the comments and I appreciate all the support. It means a whole lot to me um, and I will see you then.